Welcome to the hair segment of Janeway Halloween 2015. So you're going to need a regular brush, whatever you use is fine. Rat tail comb, little teeth, pick. Big fat curling iron. My hair is like a strawberry blonde, very, very light auburn. And Janeway's hair is, it's light brown, light auburn. It's like an autumn festival of colors and it is gorgeous and it is beautiful and it is not the color of my hair. So in order to change the color of it temporarily without dyeing it because that would be dumb for just Halloween, um, I put this in it. You are supposed to wash and towel dry your hair and then put a whole bunch of it in there. I think it got almost exactly what her color is. You know what else I'm gonna say, right? The last ingredient in any Janeway hairstyle is, ta-da, hairspray. This is Garnier Fructis. It smells really, really good. Um, it's anti-humidity. It's an extra strong hold of three of five. Three of five, that's like seven of nine. No, three of five. I'm gonna part my hair on the opposite side of where I normally part it <laughs> because that's where she parts her hair. She goes right over her eye. And it's like diagonal back. Maybe a little bit more. And tease it. I'm gonna tease it all over my head, basically. And I gave a teasing lesson in my last Janeway Updo video, but I'll give another one because they're fun to do. So, that's what you're gonna do. Take a piece of hair. Spray it. Let it dry for a hot second. Go about halfway down your hair. Start to rat it up a little bit. Then move it down your hair. Get as close to your scalp as possible. Mine touches the scalp. Now you don't want to go too close to where your part is going to be because you're going to smooth that over. So you don't want it too ratted up right where you're going to need it to settle down, okay? I'm going to do that all over my head. The hair is pretty crazy volumized right now because I tease it all over my head, all the way down to the base of my skull. Um, I think it just really helps volumize everything whenever it has been teased that way. I'm going to brush out the ends of the hair. Do not, I repeat, do not ruin any of the teasing you've done. Just go over the very top of everything. You can always flatten it later, but you cannot regain that volume without going in and teasing it again. Okay? So, I'm gonna find that part that I did. Now it's time to get curling. So, take a curling iron and just do your thing with it, you know? Put big old curls in it and let it go. Do it all over your head. Okay, now everything on my head is curled under. Of course, it has now been kind of clamped down at the bottom. So I'm gonna go through with my brush again and just kind of make sure it's all going the same way. You can also do this with a round brush if you like. Not necessary. Okay, now 
that your curled under ends are all brushed out, you're almost done with the Janeway hair. I'm just going to take this part here, which are her kind of bangs, to the front. I'm going to curl them like this. Hold them for a couple seconds, not too long, don't burn your hair off. And take it back like that. Okay? What that does is it makes it go towards the back of your head instead of right there in your face. You're going to take your 3 of 5 Not Borg hairspray. And spray it all over to set. Here is the finished Janeway hair and makeup look for In the Flesh. I'm very happy with the way this turned out. Um, I cannot wait to rock it with my jumpsuit on Halloween. And uh, I really hope that you guys have liked this tutorial and that you learned something. And message me in the comments if you have any questions. And remember, use hairspray the Jane way. I made this. No, really, I did.